Here's how to replace or repair your exhaust muffler in the snow. The well, first thing we're going to do is jack up the vehicle. We're going to remove the right rear wheel. So here's the problem that we're dealing with. This is where the muffler bolts up against the flange with these two bolts. The top bolt is completely severed causing a leak. Here's what it sounds like when you start it up. to remove these bolts so I'm going to first spray some penetrating fluid on it so we've got some holes building up here So now that the muffler is loose from the pipe, we can go ahead and remove the muffler from these rubber holders. You might want to lube it up a little bit before we undo those. One at the back and this one right here near the wheel well. Take a flat screwdriver and wedge it in and pry it off. So here we've got the original Toyota muffler taken off. As you can see, this is the flange or some of the gasket here we still have to get off. And there's two remaining bolts that we have to punch out. And on this side here you can see it's starting to leak. Both of these bushings here are in pretty good shape, so I'm going to reuse those. So this here on the old pipe is a muffler bearing. No, I'm just kidding, it's a muffler gasket. Probably need to replace this guy. Let's see how it sounds. So these studs here are actually welded on, so I'm going to grind these welds off. I've actually chosen to drill out these holes here. So I got the studs all drilled out here. I've got a 5 16 inch stainless steel bolt to replace the stud. It's about 2 inches long. I've got a washer and also a nut to go on the other side. I'm going to lube up these hanger mounts before reinstalling. Go ahead and reinstall the muffler. Make sure we clean this interface properly with the wire brush. I'm going to put a little bit of muffler cement around the gasket area. Put some on this side too. Here we've got the new muffler bearing gasket. I'm just going to install that on the flange. Stick that on there and then line this up with the muffler. Install one of the bolts at the top here. And install the second bolt at the bottom. I'm just going to put some anti seize compounds on the threads here so it doesn't seize up. Put on these washers here and the nut. Put on the other two washers on the bottom. Install the nut. Just gonna torque these down a bit here.
Last thing, I'm going to go around the connection here with some more cement to seal it off. I'm going to reinstall the wheel. Lower the vehicle. This is a cold start. Let's see how it's going to sound.